Yo, what is going on guys? It is Kevin from Ramshard and today I will be showing you a set up a custom jar file on your server. Now getting started with this is fairly simple and the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and stop your server. Then come down here to the drop down box on the server type and then click on this first box here. Scroll all the way up to the custom jar recommended build. And now once that is set, you just can go to minimize out of the control panel, come to where you have your custom jar downloaded and just go ahead and be sure it is named custom.jar. And now that you have your jar file named as custom.jar, you want to load up your FTP file access, log into your servers, and then once here, you want to be sure that you select this jar file here, drag and drop it over to the edge so it is uploaded to the home directory. Alright, and now that the custom jar file is uploaded to your server, you want to head back to your server control panel. And once you click the start button on your server, that means it is running off of the custom jar file. And you want to come to your console and just be sure it is loading up correctly and that all is well. Anyways guys, that is how you easily run your server on a custom jar, it doesn't matter what it is. If you want to run Forge on a custom jar, there will be a link to a tutorial in the description for that. There will also be a written article in the description for how running your server on a custom jar. And again guys, this has been Kevin from Ramshard. Shard.